It's me, Luca, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. We got a Fashion Nova package in the mail, and um, I'm really excited to see what this is. I was on a little bit of a budget. I don't have tons of money to just spend willy-nilly everywhere, and so I figured I'd allocate about like 2,000 crowns to go to this company, and we'll see what the quality of their jeans will be like. So this is specifically a pants video. I bought one pair of dress pants for work and then three pairs of jeans because apparently Fashion Nova has the best jeans ever. So I really want to check this out because I haven't found a good pair of jeans in a long time and I don't want to spend thousands of crowns on a pair on one single pair of jeans whereas I could spend thousands of crowns on multiple pairs of jeans. And I'm also not into the big name brands like Levi's and everyone like that and Calvin Klein and I don't care for any of them. So I haven't looked at any of these. Let's just get into this. Okay. Oh, and all of these sizes range from zero to one, I believe. Maybe a two is somewhere in there, and extra small. But apparently the extra small is a zero and a one. So, boom. Boom. Oh, and I got different colors. I got a dark wash, a light wash, a white pair of work pants. And, um... A medium wash of jeans because I need to vamp up my closet when it comes to jeans and throw out a lot of them because I've had them for over three years now three to five years minimum this is the best we're gonna get for being able to see them these are my jeans that I'm currently wearing and I just figured might as well just wear a bodysuit so then you could literally see everything from every size how they fit and these are just fake wax jeans from urban planet that i bought years ago with another pair to get them for like a dollar or a cent something like that and i do apologize for any sounds that you hear from my rabbits because now they decide to be at probably should have opened that up nice in case i have to send it back okay so these are size one I got a lot of um, ankle jeans, just so they don't do this. I don't know if you can see it, but they, they bulge up to the point where I can literally like put them over my stuff because they're just too long. So I got a bunch of ankle cut jeans so that on normal sized people, they're supposed to just end at the ankle. So I'm hoping that on me, it will just end at my ankle. So here are these jeans. These are supposed to be a butt lifting jean. They call these the uh, squat like that booty. And they do an okay job. With some help, they look pretty nice. But um, I don't know. On their website, they always have these models who look amazing, but maybe I need to have a body that like that so that I can look like them and they can't just make mine look like that because that would be amazing but yeah these jeans are super soft I'll give you a close-up they're super soft they are big because they're a one I'm not a one I'm a zero but on their website ones and zeros are the exact same measurement so maybe I'm even more of a double zero I think they're kids clothes like really neat But yeah, it's okay, because if you give it a little help, it looks okay. And these ones, they also stop at the ankle, so that's kind of nice. I don't have a massive amount of fabric that's just left there. And with them being a little bit big here, well, I can eat as much as I want, I can blow it up a bit, it won't feel uncomfortable, but it won't be like hugging my body to the point where if I sat in these, 
just like this for 10, 20 hours because I'm dry, I'm going somewhere, or traveling, whatever. They won't feel completely uncomfortable. I actually have a one that I really love because of that, and I ended up breaking it because I've had it for like five years, but it's like for maybe not had them for like three years, but they're like my favorite pair of pants, and so that's why I went here get some replacements of my pants. I wish when they said high rise, it was like higher because I'm short. I was expecting high rise to be like, at least here, this is that belly button. So I would like it to be more like mid stomach or diaphragm, just so then you're like more protected, but it does give you kind of a nice shape. Overall, it feels really soft. It's a nice color, it's a nice wash. It's definitely like a comfortable jean. It's not like real denim, I would say, because real de denim, like, you know, it feels more like a wax jean, kind of like a jegging even. Like they're really soft and just comfortable, so that's also kind of nice. Just depends on what you're looking for in your jeans. So these are also a size one. Um, they have rips on the back of the pockets. I don't know if it's supposed to be like that, but I'm pretty sure these weren't supposed to have any rips at all. Okay, that's a spare thread, so that wasn't a thing. I don't know. That's spare too. They feel really nice. They don't feel like real jeans, but they're also all high. So here's these jeans. These are not a booty lifting jean or anything like that. They're actually a little bit big everywhere because they are a one and I'm not a one, but like they are, I believe, a high rise. Yeah, they're supposed to be a high rise. So this is where they sit. Definitely not as high as um, another pair of pants that I ordered here. So I've already tried to fit them on and you're going to be seeing this in the ways that you do it. But they are about, I would say, my belly button is here, so they're right at the belly button. And yeah, these ones, eh, your butt looks okay. But you know, you can always do things to make that look better. And these, so they have a rolled ankle cuff. Can't really see it but they are a lot baggier than the other ones. And they do have rolls down that bottom of my ankles, so there is that. But otherwise, they're actually a really nice pair of jeans. I definitely wouldn't return these. Like, I wouldn't have a problem with that. They were also only $14. So, actually, all of the pants that I wear in this video the, high, the most expensive is $17.50, and then the rest are like less than $14 or $14. I'm someone who's cheap when it comes to buying jeans, so there's that. I'm not going to spend $50 on a pair of jeans, and if I do, they better be the best pair of jeans in the world. But even then, I still couldn't get these up without I'm doing the button. So these are the dark wash. These ones are actually supposed to lift your booty really nicely. So we'll definitely see. Okay. So these jeans, these are supposed to be a butt lifting jean. I kind of wish they were higher than this. And like, I almost got them on without having to undo the jeans. Um, but with the three buttons, I just couldn't. So I had to undo all three buttons and then put the belt back on. Because I really like my jeans to just slide up. Because that's typically how everything goes, even zeros. So that's why I'm kind of surprised that I ordered all ones and I still can't do that. But, so they're supposed to be butt lifting. And, yeah, you can see a little bit of a lift. But if you really want to, like, try, then it's like, yeah, okay. Your butt actually looks really nice. Now, the one thing that I really love, I don't have rolls. They fit perfectly. So, I would recommend if you are 
around five feet to go to Fashion Nova and um, just order their ankle jeans because you'll finally have jeans that don't roll and they fully fit your ankle. I'm just hoping if they shrink, same thing's not going to happen where now your jeans are too short because, I don't know, jeans either shrink or they stretch. They don't have an in-between. And Well, for me, my problem is stretching. Never had them shrink, but I know jeans too shrink. So, but majority of mine stretch because after a certain point, I will be able to put these on without having to undo them at all. And um, I didn't lose any weight. I just stayed the same. But yeah, book profile. Like I said, if you like do a pose, then yeah, it actually looks pretty good. And then we'll just do a close up what they look like at the top, all the way around. They're definitely not bad. They're actually really nice. So this is zero. Okay, so these are an extra small. And um, they're sheer. Very, very see through. So you will be able to see my red bodysuit through this for sure. Well, at least I'm wearing a body. So here's a close up. These are an insane high rise. And uh, yeah, completely see through. You can see my bodysuit through it. Thank goodness it's not underwear. But yeah, and um, these ones. There's a lot of extra fabric down here at the ankle, which you know, they're not that bad in quality. They kind of feel nice. I just wish um, they weren't see-through. <laughs> but I figured with buying a pair of white pants, 99.9% of the time, they are see-through. And I don't know why it can't be like up here at the stomach all the way down. Like why is there this color change? Why couldn't they make it all like this? material because that would look a lot nicer than basically just being a see-through pair of pants from the waist down which most people aren't going to see this because you'd have a shirt over it so i don't know what to say about that there but they do look really good and they give you a really nice shape actually at least yeah they give you a nice shape But I'll give you a full turn. Hmm. They're not so bad. I can definitely work with them. Probably use that bodysuit that I bought from um, Everything Five Pounds a long time ago in my other video where I was like, oh yeah, I could just cut this out and then it'll be protection from see-through things because it's tan, and so these pants might be perfect to do that with. So, we'll see. So, my final thoughts on all of these, um, maybe just so you can see a better view. See, they fit my ankle perfectly. I don't know. A lot of them are just exactly at my ankle except for the light wash ones. Those ones um, were a little bit more baggy on the way down, which is also kind of funny because they're folded and I might just fold them again and maybe that'll look okay. Um, but my final reviews for these pants are these jeans are incredibly soft. I'm still wearing the very first one because I kind of filmed it all backwards and we're just gonna put it together and make it look normal. But anyways, so I have two hands, so two pairs of jeans. These feel really soft, really nice. They're definitely like a wax type of material or a jegging type of material. They're not jeans, like jean jeans, but they're also not expensive jeans. And that was kind of another thing for me. I was like, well, because I'm someone who doesn't want to spend tons and tons of money, I want to be able to provide my audience with the ability to find cheap jeans as well because not everybody is rich. Not everybody is out here and can just spend hundreds of thousands of dollars each year on clothes in general. And 
And for me, I don't make money off of YouTube yet. Like, I got 50 subscribers, which by the way, thank you to those 50 subscribers that I finally have. Let's make it a hundred. That would be amazing. A thousand would even be better because then I could finally monetize this channel and actually get things to make the videos better, get into more depth with things and actually find a niche to go into. Cause right now I'm not getting any reasons, like any specific videos that you guys are subscribing from. So I don't exactly know what you want to see. So please definitely let me know in the comments. Um, but for now, every time I buy something, I'm going to make a video about it. And so, yeah, these jeans are amazing. And Fashion Nova will probably be my place for jeans, to be honest now, because they're great. Another amazing thing about the website is even though they're based in the United States, Europeans can pay taxes directly there and pay your VAT. So then you just get a really easy way to get your package out to you. And they still do it within a decent amount of time. So what I was originally planning for this video was I was about to get five pairs so four pairs of jeans and the white pants. And then I was also going to get a belt because I was like, oh, then it'll all equal up to 2,000 crowns because that's what I was wanting to spend. And then it was like, oh, you can just pay your taxes. I'm like, well, now I'm going to have to pay the taxes on all of this. Well, I'm going to remove some things. So that's when I ended up going down to four so that then the amount that I'm spending, it was actually just a little bit less than 2,000 crowns. And I was still getting free shipping on top of all of it with taxes and everything. So I literally got all the items today. I believe I made the purchase maybe two weeks ago, last like two Thursdays ago. And like, that's amazing because I ordered another product, which I might have another video come out about that. They're gonna charge an arm and a leg for the VAT, for the shipping, and for bringing it through the customs process. And they were like, well, even if you went and did this on your own, it's gonna be the same price. And it's like, why? Just why? And so I really like how they allow you to pay the VAT beforehand. So then you can just get your stuff in the mail and you don't have to worry about anything. And um, for these white pairs of jeans, it's actually a really good quality. Like it feels really nice. Oh, and by the way, all the extra fabric I found on these jeans, because there was quite a bit of strings and whatnot, they just turned out to just be there. So... It's probably from them just sitting in a warehouse or whatever. But um, yeah, these white, this white pair is actually really nice quality and it feels really good. And it's um, feels like that business material that I never remember the name. It's spandex, nylon, and rayon. Okay, maybe it does feel like rayon. But yeah, it's rayon, so it has like that really nice business feeling material. I just wish all the fabric was like up here so that um, it's not see-through. Was that too hard to ask? But like, I can still make these work and I'll probably still wear them. And I don't think I'm gonna be returning any of this. And even then, they seem to make returning products really easy because I know a lot of companies just for you to not return things, they go, oh, you have to pay your own return shipping and you have to notify us before you do it. And then you have to do it within a certain set of time. So then you're just paying more money to return the stuff, even though you didn't pay a lot in the first place to get the stuff. So then is it all really worth it? But for me, I think this is worth it. I think buying jeans at least there is worth it. The rest of the clothes really aren't my style. They're kind of more like going to clubs and parties and really showing off your body, which just isn't my thing. And so I think for me, they'll just mainly be a jean store though. If we monetize my channel, then I'll go and explore into the other things. So at least if I'm spending money on stuff that I won't wear, I'll be making it back. So we'll see in the future. So if you guys wanna go and get me a thousand subscribers. So like this video, subscribe to my channel and tell me what you want to see like i really want to know what you guys want to see and now this video is going to be further out and there are going to be videos that come out before it so you might not see what you want to see right away but once i have what you guys want to see then i'll definitely make the video for it and you'll just see it a little bit later because i am about four videos in advance which is good because if i wasn't 
you wouldn't be getting stuff. Like you just, you would not be getting content <laughs> because I just don't have time to film with my husband still working from home. And once he's gone, I'll have tons of days to film when he's not here and I'm not working. So it'll be amazing. And then once he starts to go back to the gym on my days where I am still working over like through the night and he's gone, I can still sit down and chat and then just go and take care of a customer if they come in. But typically at four in the morning, nobody is like, so do let me know. I want to hear about it. I want to hear what you guys want to hear about. You can ask me questions, whatever. Maybe I'll do a Q&A video if I get enough. So just let me know. And till then, I'll see you next time. Bye. You can go and check out some videos here and some videos here. YouTube is going to recommend you something. And then this is another video that is um, similar to this one. So check them out.